Bienvenidos, welcome to Spain on a Fork. I hope your New Year's off to a great start and you're staying safe out there. Anyways, today we've got another great recipe. We're making a Spanish bean stew. This stew has so many different dimensions of flavors. It's very easy to make, like seriously, you are not gonna believe how easy it is to put this together. And it's made with the most basic and humble ingredients, folks. This stew right here is gonna fill your soul with so much goodness, the perfect dish for a cold winter's day or any time of the year. Really quick before we get started, a shout out to one of my patrons, Mac Morford. Once again, Mac, thank you for being a patron of Spain on a Fork. You know how much I appreciate you. For the rest of you, if you're not with me on Patreon, consider becoming one. Helps with ingredients and equipment to continue making videos like this. You'll find my Patreon link in the description box below and iCard above. So let's just dive right into this recipe. I'm gonna grab a stock pot, heat it with a medium high heat, and add in a quarter cup of extra virgin olive oil. After heating the olive oil between 60 to 90 seconds, I'm gonna add in half of a green bell pepper and half of a red bell pepper that I roughly diced. One large carrot that I also roughly diced, I peeled it beforehand. And half of an onion that I finely diced. And start mixing these vegetables around with that extra virgin olive oil. You wanna mix this continuously. We are on a medium high heat, that way the vegetables don't burn and they all cook evenly. about eight minutes after adding the vegetables into the stock pot and they're developing a light golden fried color, I'm gonna add in four cloves of garlic that I finely minced and continue to mix these vegetables around with that olive oil. We're only gonna go between 20 to 30 seconds on the garlic. You don't wanna overcook it, otherwise it gets a bitter flavor. We just want it to be nice and aromatic. Then I'm gonna add in two tomatoes that I finely grated. Basically, I grated these tomatoes with a grater. If you don't have one of these, you can substitute this for about one third cup of canned tomato sauce. And I'm also gonna add in two teaspoons of sweet smoked Spanish paprika. And we're gonna give this a quick mix. That way all these vegetables are evenly mixed together and simmer that grated tomato for about two minutes or until it's thickened up. Once the grated tomato has thickened up and it's been incorporated into the rest of the vegetables, let's add our beans in there. I'm gonna add in one cup of cooked chickpeas, one cup of cooked white beans, and one cup of cooked kidney beans. Basically, these are all pre-cooked canned beans that I added into a strainer and rinse under some cold running water to remove any of the preservatives. And season everything with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And we're gonna give this a gentle mix that way all these ingredients are evenly mixed together. Once again, remember to be gentle here. You don't wanna break those beans apart. Once everything's well mixed, I'm gonna add in a generous two and a half cups of vegetable broth. The one that I'm using is homemade. You'll find the recipe on how to make it in the iCard above. And we're also gonna add in one bay leaf. And we'll give this a quick mix, that way everything's evenly mixed together and we're gonna let this sit here on medium high heat until it comes to a boil. Once that broth comes to a boil, I'm gonna place the lid over the stock pot, lower the fire from a medium high heat to a low medium heat. And we're gonna let this sit here for about 20 minutes on a low medium heat. This is enough time for all these flavors to come together and for that vegetable broth to really thicken up. After about 20 minutes, I'm gonna remove the lid from the stock pot and check it out. Look how beautiful this Spanish bean stew looks. That broth has really thickened up and all these flavors have came together. I'm gonna add in a generous one and a half tablespoons of freshly chopped parsley Mix it in there, that way it's well incorporated into the stew. And remove the stock pot from the heat. And look at this, our Spanish bean stew is done. So many incredible aromas coming out of this and you saw it, super easy to put this together. Let's give it a try and see how it tastes.
This stew truly came out looking so delicious. Here we go. Everything is kind of melts in your mouth. You know, the combination of those three beans, that chickpeas, white beans, and kidney beans, so many different textures and flavors, and then that sweet smoked Spanish paprika is what really shines through. It is the star of this stew. You'll find a link to the one that I'm using in the description box below. You saw this, a Spanish bean stew, very easy to make, humble and simple ingredients, comes together in about 40 minutes, folks. It doesn't get better than this. If you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button, leave me a comment below, and if you're not subscribed, smash that subscribe button. Till the next time, hasta luego.